legends say that when the world was young, the god of fertility spat on the earth and created Lake Cerulea. People thought that was gross, so... <coughs> <coughs> so, they changed the spitting part to a teardrop instead. For all we know, it could have been his best. But whatever came out of the guy, it formed this magical lake. It was so magical that the land became really rich, doing what man does best. They took the lake for themselves and made ridiculously huge homes, castles, and other stuff. This is how the kingdom of Cerulea came to be. Cerulea's wealth didn't go unnoticed for too long. Soon, trade came from the kingdom of Alcos, an exotic land of unchecked capitalism. It's said that these people were so good with money that they were bad at everything else, even when it comes to protecting their own home. And that brings us to the Gegners! War-hungry barbarians who'll kill anyone that gets in their way. Long story short, they're the bad guys. Everyone hates them and that's all you need to know. <laughs> anyway, that's the world so far. Did you get all that? Well, good for you, you nerd. But all those things don't really matter. Wanna know why? Cause you're here for the girls. <laughs> that's why. <laughs> and to get them, you've gotta go through something that does matter. My story. Well, <laughs> that was some, um, oh yes, look at this, oh, look at this, <laughs> look at this intro screen right here, title screen right here. <laughs> well, I'm not sure if I should actually like, kind of like, censor this, may, I don't think so, maybe? <laughs> but yes, anyway, uh, welcome to a new vision of a slash RPG playthrough of this, uh, yeah, of this game called Love Esquire, yes. Um, this is actually a game by Yang Yang Mobile. Yes, the same company who created the letter. Uh, if you have heard of the letter, you think it's great. I do think it's great to the letter. If you have not played the letter, I would recommend checking it out because uh, what I like about the letter is basically the the choices that you have to make to, to unlock certain, yeah, certain, uh, to unlock you know, endings and such, and the right route, and, and the good endings and such, and the true ending, you know, that yeah, your your choices will will determine what kind of route you'll be taking, you know, in the letter. And, I, and it's, it's a horror vision of it, by the way, so I would re actually recommend checking it out. It, it's quite a pretty, pretty cool vision of it. Yeah, there are some flaws here and there, but, but the, what I love most about the letter is basically the characters and all that. Okay, but yeah, if you haven't checked out the letter, please do, but right now, we're gonna check out this Love Esquire. Well, I I bought this game like about a year ago when it, when it was on Kickstarter. Yeah, because I was like immediately sold by this. Yeah, just now you saw that prologue video, right? <laughs> that prologue video is about what uh, Earth, and then I don't know what the guy did, and then then it talks about some uh, gag gagners or whatever. Said Zerulia is the uh, name of this world, but ultimately, what's most important about this game? It's of course you want to get the wife roots. That's what's most important. Nothing else matters, and that's why I'm playing this vision of a slash RPG. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, that's why I'm playing this. And yeah, if you listen to the background, this really feels like some goddess music or what. <laughs> yes. So I know that. So there, as you can see, there are like five wife roots here, and there's also a harem root. So there are like five choices plus the harem root. So there are like six roots in total. <laughs> So, of course, I'm gonna go for all of them. What? But which girl will I go first? Well, that depends. But anyway, yeah, let's not waste time. Let's go to start a new game right here. And, oh yeah, and and that being said, because I'm playing Love Aspire, uh, yes, by right, it should be Sabat of the Witch right now, but um, I'm pausing Sabat of the Witch for now to play this vision novel. It, yeah, slash RPG called Love Aspire because it's. I think it's is the in thing right now, this vision of it. And I can't wait to play it, so let's go. New game. Right, so enter my name. I'm just yeah. I'm gonna enter my main name, which is it's the ETI switch. I'm pretty sure this guy has a has a given has a like default name, right? I'm just not sure. So here you see the slide mode, I'm just here for the story or give me some challenge. 
Now, of course, I'm going to choose give me some challenge because I'm not here just for the story. I'm here for the gameplay too. So, yeah, the RPG at gameplay. So let's go confirm. Right, let's proceed. Wait, I'm gonna save slot one. I only need like six slots. Okay. Bro, wake up! Hey, Amy, what's up? Who are you? We are at Monday, uh, first, first of January. Seems like it at six a.m. in the morning. Just five more hours. And this is a good thing that the, the, the main protagonist has his own voiceover as well, so I don't actually have to you know, speak except for the narratives. But I know that this vision novel is actually partially voiced. It's not completely voiced, so yeah. You can't sleep the whole morning. Of course I can. Why, why can't I? See? <laughs> Who's Amy though? I think maybe Amy is uh, my... My sister? Nah, -uh, not today. Oh shit, what you gonna do? Give me tucks on my sheets. The cold starts creeping. It's cold. Oh shit, oh, yeah, January. <laughs> cold, huh? I can fix that. Oh, what, what are you gonna do? Though? Are you gonna hug me? Amy ambush! Oh shit, don't spring on me. W wait! <laughs> what? We got CG. Happy birthday! Amy and Bush, new achievement, that's fast. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, wait, let me just right click here. Oh, can I? Oh, how do I hide the, 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 the top text box? So, let me, let me check something. Alright, this is. Uh, let me just check the menu real quick, check the options. I want to see how do you like uh, hide the. Did you show subtitle, blah blah blah, display, full screen, language, sound, um, what? Nothing? I just don't know how do you like hide the text box. Hmm. So divide info, stylized, uh, stylized text transition. I think I'll just keep it the default. Okay, uh then just explore. Auto skip backlog. How do I like you did click this button here? Oh no. <laughs> it's just to go to the next text. Okay, but this I presume is the one of the yeah, it's one of the five earrings, Amy, okay. So Amy presses her chest against my arm. Uh, hmm, I just want to know how do you like hide the text box? Though? I know we can see the backlog here. How do you like escape? Maybe let me just check something. Oh no, escape is just to this one. Hmm, you could use well, this could use some controls because I need to know at least what the controls are. But the problem is the the options doesn't really show the the the, the controls. So. Okay, texture quality will change the main menu. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, maybe I should like go back to the main menu for a bit, so give me a sec here. Okay, I found the control, I just I was just try trial and error because that the, the one bad thing is that about is that they didn't show the controls, so I don't know what to press to actually hide the <laughs> hide the text box. Because usually, you know, in vision novels you want to hide a text box, it's usually the right mouse button. Yeah, for me, I'm used to pressing the right mouse button to hide the, the, the text box, but no, not for this uh, vision of the though. And, uh, and too bad you can't really like change the controls for for certain things. So, hmm, one thing to take note, young, young mobile. But yeah, I figured out the key to hide the text box, which, which is hitch. So there we go. Perfect CG. If we have Amy here, I think he seems like, seems like she's like what? Like resting, <laughs> like pinning, pinning, uh, pinning, pinning me down. <laughs> Seems like it. Okay. <laughs> it's like, ouch! Why do you have to wake me up like this? But wait, today's my birthday too. Oh man, today's my birthday. Amy presses her chest against my arm. Ow, ow! Oh boy, am I feeling something? That's sir to you, sis. Yes, sir, sir, Pierce. So I switch, so I pure switch. What are you yapping on about? Starting today, I'm gonna be a squire. Hugh's a squire. Hugh's squire? I thought uh, Hugh is probably my master or something. Really now? Then happy birthday, sir squire. <laughs> you, you say you say happy birthday to me while while, while wrestling my arm. <laughs> so where'd you get me? 
something you'll definitely like. Oh, oh, twisting my arm, I see. I like that. I like being masochistic. So you better give me something good for my birthday as well. Sure. Oh, your birthday? I don't know when your birthday is. You do remember, right? No, I don't. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Oh, shit, don't tighten my arm though. Damn. When was it again? I could have sworn I wrote that down on my calendar. Do we have a calendar now? Or is it the 1st of January? Yay! I can't wait! Shit. <laughs> I don't remember. I don't even know. Now off to breakfast. Alright. Just give me a sec. Let me just take a look at this. At her again. Yeah, it seems like she's lying down right? But what was this? This one I think is her hat. Yeah, it's her hat. Right? It's her hat. Yeah. See you downstairs! Alright. Stop, stop pulling my arm! Okay, fast forward to 7am. Oh, what, what the heck is this? What the heck is this thing right here? <laughs> this poster! You trying to be a macho? Muscle man? Macho man? Okay, but Amy's birthday, huh? I should check the calendar before going downstairs. Alright, I should check, let's check. So I've marked it here somewhere. 18... So 18 January is her birthday. Oh, I can't press H now to hide the thing. But what do we have here? This, this girl named Ibrain Lasha Lash Fiona. <laughs> Looks really sexy. Okay, but okay, 18th of January is her birthday, Amy. Right, um mark here. So holy boss, it's a few days away. I better think of something fast. What? what? A few days away. Today's the first of January. It's like it's like more than two weeks later. <laughs> it's not really a few days away. Dude, it's a good thing I wrote it down. From now on, if something important happens, I'll be writing it down here. Right, so 18th of January is Amy's birthday. But for now, let's celebrate my, my birthday on the 1st of January. Time to go, Amy's waiting. I need to see this poster though. <laughs> this macho photo. Okay, so alright. This kind of seems like... You know, there's there's this kind of game where you where you have where you're inside a room. Yeah, it's a point. that kind, you know, the point and click type of adventure where you're inside a room and then you can interact with certain things inside this room, and then you want to exit, you can exit and that sort of thing. Yeah, this that's why you call a point and click adventure games, right? Okay, but let's go. Amy's waiting. 18 January, right? It's her birthday. Gotcha. Oh man, that smells good. 7 a.m. Are those sausages? Oh, fried eggs and fresh fruit stew. These are peaches, right? Peaches that look like um uh boobies. <laughs> of course, pe boobies for breakfast. Yes, of peaches. And yeah, there's pears, sausages, tomatoes, eggs, and pe pie. Apple pie. So that yeah, there's even apple pie. I feel like a king. So this is why Amy was so eager, she wants to cook for you. Maybe I should sweeten her up so she does this again next year. Why must it be next year though? Why can't it be every day? Amy, did you do something with your hair? You're looking absolutely stunning today. I wonder what what relationship if, uh, I have with Amy though. Is she like... Like, sister? I don't think it's sister though. I think it's probably yeah a girlfriend but... Probably his my first girlfriend or something. I mean, they're really like, living together. You really think so? Okay, so let's let's just take a look at Amy in her sprite form. Yeah, yeah I mean, I mean, you look at Amy; she's blushing. So yeah, she's definitely not um not my sister, not the Squire's sister, but probably a very close friend. Yeah, later going to be girlfriend if I choose her. That is. Mm -hmm. Okay. Shampoo. Herbal shampoo, huh? Gotcha. Hey, wait a minute. I know what you're up to. What am I up to? <laughs> That's Pops. <laughs> That's actually my dad. Okay, but I can't see your eyes. Why are you so tall? <laughs> Look at you, lad. Getting manlier and manlier each year. Why, thank you, but I need to see your eyes. Morning, Pops. So you're a squire now, eh? You better work on those muscles, boy. Alright, but we don't need always need muscles to win, no? 
Don't you worry, Pops. Give me a few months and I'll be ripped like you in no time. Oh, wow. This guy sounds so proud. A few months. Really now? I think Amy is most likely a very close friend of... Yeah. If not childhood friend of, of the main protagonist. Of, yeah. The squire. That's me. Are you sure you can handle? And the what? With one sweeping motion, Pop rips off his shirt as usual. Oh, don't remind me of that dumbbell. <laughs> of that dumbbell guy. <laughs> oh shit. Please. Yeah, I know, I know, you're ripped, okay? But you don't have to be like the, the macho guy in, in dumb, the, that dumbbell anime. <laughs> oh, you think you can get these in a few months? <laughs> Your muscles have a long way to go, lad. Oh, I all prove you, though. I don't need that much muscles. Can't you see? Look at him! <laughs> right, show off. Show off? <laughs> see, I'm so good with this. I'm so good with vision novels. I knew, I knew, I knew <laughs> the main hero would kind of say show off. And, I'm, and I haven't read this before. I'm playing it blind. <laughs> Someday, Pops. Just you wait. Yeah, just you wait. Oh, <laughs> don't worry. You'll get there. Alright. I'll challenge you to to arm wrestling. Oh, and uh, Amy, did you give him his gift yet? Oh, gift? What? What? Oh, yeah, today is my birthday, right? You haven't given me my gift. Oh, yeah, I almost forgot. And you, and you wish me happy birthday. Here you go, bro, for your squirely day. Oh, so you're really my my sister? <laughs> my queer son, she's one of the heroines. I could be wrong though. Yeah. 50 gold? Fertility God's booty! 50 gold and some nice looking clothing. And look! A new set of armor! New set of armor, okay. Uh, that's cool at this. It's kind of simple, but still pricey for folks like us. Aww. Thanks, you guys. <laughs> Thanks, you guys. Give them a well deserved hug, oh, including your pops. You like it. But I mean the fact that Amy is like really blushing means are we gonna is there gonna be an incest fruit? I have a feeling that there, there is. Yeah, because I think Amy is one of the five heroines here, I'm pretty sure so there's gonna be incest. Huh. <laughs> I mean look at look just look at Amy, you know, blushing, you know. a boy, wear that armor and make us proud. Sure, sure, Pops. Of course I will! Yeah, of course I will. Oh, and the fun's not over yet. That's gonna give us some more money for drinking, aren't you, Dad? Oh, for drinking. We can drink. We're at a legal age. Of course! What kind of responsible father would I be if I let my son stay sober on his birthday, eh? <laughs> so I shouldn't stay sober on my birthday. Sweet! You coming with us, Pops? Nah, I can't, son. Sorry. Why? Why, why can't you? Come on, not even for my birthday? Uh, I'm afraid so. Still work to do. Barn needs a fix in before winter. Oh. Well, I guess we'll celebrate back home. Who's gonna do all that drunk singing then? <laughs> drunk singing. I'll be more than happy to sing for you, bro. Oh, you will? Uh oh. Oh, sounds like Amy's bad at singing. Please, Pops, come with us. I can't stand Amy singing! Oh, that's Vlad. Hey! <laughs> You'll be fine. Alright. And Amy, don't forget to be back here before sundown. Before sundown, huh? Gotcha, Dad! Have fun, kids! Alright, we're going to the bars. First thing in the morning. I guess the farmer's work is never done. So, bro, should we get going? Sure. Remember, 18 January is Amy's birthday. Uh, I think I still have to. Oh, no excuses though. Alright, I'll just meet you at the tavern. Tavern, alright, tavern it is. See you there! Alright, so I think we can explore some stuff in the meantime, right? Oh, it's already 10 a.m. though. We got 50 gold. That's like 3 hours later, so we had like kind of like break breakfast for quite a while, and it's 10 a.m. in the morning. Oh yeah, we cannot interact some stuff. Let's see, what, what can we interact here? Uh, maybe we can go back... No, we can't go back to our room for now. 
And then doesn't seem to be anything else we can interact here, so I guess we just go to the next area. Yeah, we just head out. Okay, let's see. Anything here? Let's see. Oh, oh, at least I can interact, you see? Some bells. <laughs> Let me just go back. Oh, can I go back? No, I can't. I can't go back into the house. At least I can shake some stuff here. Uh, yeah, and plants can move too. Can I swing this axe? Oh, that I can. I can at least interact with some stuff. Ah, I should have interacted with the stuff inside the house. Oh well, but buddy, no, why you fly away, buddy? <laughs> buddy, don't fly away. Come on, buddy. Hi, buddy. Hi. I can't interact with the bird. Why you fly away? Okay, anyway, let's let's move on. Alright, so we're now home. I mean, there's nowhere else we can go except the Taven. <laughs> there's like other places like the castle, the plaza, the barracks, the infirmary. The archives and the outskirts. So outskirts is where we miss the dungeons and all. We can't go to the infirmary now, even though it's not great out. I guess we we'll go. The only place we can go to anyway now is the infirmary. So I mean the the tavern. So let's go. So if we go to the tavern, the arrival time will be twelve p.m. What we take two hours just to get from home to tavern. All right. Uh, but it's not like we can do anything else here. So yeah, nothing else we can interact. So let's go. To the Taven. Oh, but let me let me just check a few more things here. Maybe I thought maybe there'll be like items or something. Okay, but nothing. Let's go. So we take two hours just to walk to the Taven. Hmm. Amy isn't here yet. Oh well. Okay, let me just take a look at the Taven. I mean, it's just a it's just a Taven. So. <laughs> Whoa! This place is packed. Excuse me. Who are you, you eyeless guy? <laughs> oh, sorry. God, screw you. Get lost. I'm not. I'm not gonna what. I'm not gonna as. I'm not gonna let you get your way. No, I'm not gonna excuse myself. Hey, I heard Val broke if you shares on the way out. Okay, so smelly villager, eyeless guy, another one. Again, boy, what a troublemaker. Other makers, huh? Might be something I'll have to deal with as a squire soon. Anyway, Amy should be right about should be here right about now. No. Anytime now, Amy. Why are you late? Man, this sucks. What's taking her so long? Maybe she got Maybe some she got into some trouble? Uh, I should probably wait outside. I don't wanna look like some loser who got ditched on the date. <laughs> Well, if I were him, I would have kind of done the same thing, but not because of this reason, not because I, I look like some loser who took a ditch on a date. I just don't like being alone in a public, in a, in a, like a restaurant or a table. Yeah. yeah. If I want to eat, I, I prefer to take out, you know, yeah, I prefer to take away or take out for, yeah, for meals. Yeah. And not eat at, the, at that place. Rarely do I actually eat at a restaurant alone, so. Or a yeah, or food court alone, you know. So, okay, uh, anyway, you can only get out, nothing else we can do, so. Alright. So, alright, let's kill some time, and our two should do the trick. Alright, our two should do the trick, um, but, well, this is the only option, so we're learning some things. So, uh, hour or two, it's just one hour there, because he said hour or two, so let's just skip one hour. We wait for one hour. That should be enough, Amy should be at the table by now. Right, so, uh, yeah, I mean, let's go. Hey bro, sorry I'm late. I forgot to give the potatoes a good scolding today. <laughs> what do you mean, you forgot to give the potatoes a good scolding? Why do you need to scold the potatoes? <laughs> what? You, you what? what? Oh, never mind. Ugh, never mind. Let's just get this party started. I forgot the main protagonist has a voice. Uh, it's been a while, but this place still smells like piss. It's the Taven. Too bad Pops couldn't come with us. I know, bro. But come on, I'll just sing for you so you can drop the long face, okay? Oh my god, when you sing. I will actually want to hear... Amy sing for once, then let's see how the table reacts. <laughs> how the people at the table react. 
No thanks. Happy birthday to. <laughs> that doesn't sound half bad. Oh, are we starting this party early? Who's this? <gasps> oh no, it's him. Ooh. Happy birthday, kiddo. Kyuf, who are you? Kyuf, <laughs> you look like some I don't know. Kyuf. <laughs> oh, well, she, Amy doesn't look pleased though. So, what you get me? You know it's my birthday today, right? I don't need to get your ass anything. I just made you my squire. Why do I want to be your squire? I don't want to be your squire. That's it? No big debut or anything? Debut? You're not that important. And get out of my face. <laughs> well, thanks for rubbing it in. Okay, since you're so desperate for a gift, how about I treat you guys to the house special? Pouring stew. Pouring stew? What was it made of? You mean slime stew? Shit. Gross. You're not treating me with that sludge. Oh no, I don't want slime stew. Bro, have some respect. It's a cerulean delicacy. Generations of chefs toiled to perfect that recipe. Yeah, but I don't like slime food. <laughs> I don't want to eat slime. Slimes are so cute. For someone who cooks so well, you sure have shit taste, Amy. Oh my god, that's so blunt. <laughs> You better get used to it. Out on the battlefield, that's all you'll be eating. Oh, like rations? Oh, and speaking of the battlefield, I've got some great news for you. All right. What? Can we earn some big money? There's a war coming up! Oh, that's not cool. War? What? War? Who, who told you that? Yes! I hope you're not too attached to your arms. Why do you sound so excited, though, over war? Great news? Are you shitting me? I shit you not, kid. You're so eager to go go on war. Okay, okay. I got this. Who are we up against? Bandits? Thieves? Bandits and thieves would be good though. No, Squire. Even better. Oh shit. The Gegner Barbarians! Oh, I heard of those Gegner in the prologue video. Ah, those are half though, I think. Barbarians? That doesn't sound so bad. They're usually dumb and disorganized, right? I hope. Yes, but they're twice our size and there's a horde of them to deal with. So are you saying only the two of us are going to deal with them? Ah, I remember the last horde I fought. Good times. I remember my squire back then. Good old Podrick. Oh, what happened to him? What happened to him? Yeah. Is he a knight now? He's dead, I think. <laughs> oh, no. He's dead! Could have dodged that arrow to the knee. See, why am I so good at predicting stuff? <laughs> He's dead! He's really dead! <laughs> yeah, even I even predicted the what happened to him, no? <laughs> Don't worry though, it's not so bad. If you die in battle, you get a medal. Um but that's a posthumous medal. I don't want a posthumous medal. That doesn't make me feel any better. And why are we dealing with this mess in the first place? Yeah, why? Well, the Alcozi want help defending their home. Who's the Alcozi? <laughs> Those traitors from the east? Why do we have to fight their war? Hmm. Because we're next on the Horde's list if Alcos falls. I see, so we have to protect Alcos. But I, I haven't even started training yet. Don't worry, you've got four months. That's plenty of time. Four months before the war starts? Four months? I've only got four months to live! <laughs> if four months is a lot of time, you know. Hey, the squire mortality rate is at an all-time low. Only 80%. Um, 80% is very high. <laughs> are, are you kidding me? I, I can't die this young. There's so many things I still have to do. What about my family? What about all the beer I need to drink? What about Amy? What about my cow? Who's gonna take Messy. Amy will. <laughs> uh. And what about love? I'm a young single bachelor in his prime. Yes, we need to find love. I want to meet a girl. I want to know what love is. That's the whole point of this vision novel. Oh God, I haven't even had my first kiss yet. 
I haven't even experienced man's greatest pleasure. Oh yes, of course. We're here for the man's greatest pleasure, right? What? You don't know what is man's greatest pleasure, goddammit. You're not a man. You know? I haven't even gotten laid yet. You! I don't want to die a virgin! <laughs> of course, who wants to die a virgin? Get a hold of yourself, damn it! Those are some priorities at, you've got there. But I totally get you. Look at, look at Amy. <laughs> like, like, like chuckling in the background. <laughs> Yeah, it's cool to see that, you know, background characters also have, like, expressions of their own. Yeah, even though we're actually focusing on the person that we're talking to, but sometimes the background characters also have their own moments, you know, like this. <laughs> you're, you're a virgin too? Shit, then I don't want to hang out with you. No, that's not it. Oh, you're joking. No, 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 you're lying. I'm talking about finding love. Many knights dream of finding their fair maiden. You know, having a girl worth fighting for. I have Amy to fight for. <laughs> I'll tell you what, since it's the knightly thing to do, I'll allow you time for personal endeavors. Okay, how much time? Does that sound good to you? How much time? Gee, thanks. That definitely makes up for dropping the bomb on me like this. And on my birthday, of all days. <laughs> Yeah, that, that, that's really... no. Well, this had to happen one way or another. But since you're so concerned, why don't I give you a head start? Give me a head start? What head start? See those ladies over there? Go talk to them! <laughs> okay. What? Oh, oh, are you jealous, Amy? <laughs> you mean right now? What's this? S some kind of training? Might as well take it that way. Yes, Squire! Charisma training, to be exact! This'll be fun to watch. This guy's got zero appeal. Oh, but you're attracted to me, Amy. You were... You were, you were blushing. <laughs> I do not. I'll show you. But if I show her, then she'll get jealous, right? Amy will get jealous if I show her. Then do it! Five ladies. Get me their names. Five ladies? So Amy is not one of the heroines, I guess. <laughs> oh boy. Like you're gonna be able to pull that off, bro. Can't wait to see you fail. Good luck! I'll be expecting those names. Don't 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 smirk like that. Um Amy, don't You stands up. Where's he going? Hey, leaving us already? Sorry, kiddo. I need to finish your squire papers before sundown. I've also got <clears throat> night stuff to do. Right, what kind of night stuff? That's a shame. Well, thanks, you. By the way, I love the great news. You definitely didn't kill the mood or anything. Oh, well, well, why must the why must the MC sound so sarcastic? <laughs> no problem. Happy birthday. No gifts, no nothing. Just saying happy birthday. <sighs> I did. What a dumbass. <laughs> All right, so we have things to do. Oh, right, it's three p.m. <sighs> This beer is just what I needed, especially after hearing all of that. I thought we were supposed to get the names of five ladies not from here. If it's not from here, then I guess it's fine. We can, we'll can. definitely find five ladies. What a day, Amy. What a day. I really wish Pops was here. Oh, wait! Dad! What about him? Thanks for reminding me, bro. You going back? Huh? What about him? I'm supposed to go home before sundown. He needs help. Oh, okay. But it's not but it's not really sundown yet. It's still 3 p.m. <laughs> sundown only happens at like 5 p.m. Right? Yeah. Well if you consider this can this place to be away from the equator. But if it's can if it's areas near the equator then sundown only happens at around like um, 7 p.m. six between six thirty and seven p.m. Around there? Yeah. So you're just gonna leave me here? Yeah, you're just gonna leave me here? It's only 3 p.m. Yep. Besides, you've got that charisma training to do. Alright, charisma training to do, alright. I'd love to see you fail, but I've gotta be a good daughter and go home. Alright, but I will succeed. Fail? I'm not gonna fail. Wanna bet on it? Let's bet on it. 
Nah, it's your birthday, so I'll let you off the hook. Alright, but what about the next day? I'm not gonna lose. Sure, sure. Anyway, bye, bro. And good luck. Yeah, I don't need luck. <laughs> I'll show you. <laughs> Alright, so we're at the table now. We're supposed to interact here. Amy will regret doubting me. So we're just going to go to the... I mean, this is the only thing we can click, so we're just going to go to the... the the counter. Oh, we have something here. It's called what? Training ground. It's charisma improves my cheer, but buff heal for more damage. Oh, okay. But first, there's the easy mode, which costs ten coins. I guess we check it out. Time to boost my socks appeal. All right, let's start. I guess. So, here often. Oh shit! He's now talking to the girls. To... Come back. Drink oh, or on me. Okay, he, he talked to a girl, but nothing happened. And he got drunk in the end. <laughs> well, you did gain a few experience. Just a little more grinding before you could. Oh, sure. So let's, let's do it again. We, let's eat. Okay, we can't do it again, though. Yeah, this is just tutorial, I guess, at this point. No luck so far, don't worry. We'll get more experience. Damn it, I thought this would be easy. Oh, there's someone over there. Let's try this one last time. Who's this girl right here? Hmm, but it's, she's eyeless, so I, I don't think she's uh, one of the main heroines. Hey there. Yes. Yes. <laughs> cute villager. I should put a question mark there. Cute villager. I mean, she looks cute, if only she has eyes. Listen, lady. I'm not here to flirt. I've been failing at that for the whole night. I just want to know your name. It's for a bet. Please. At least, at least, I'm being honest right here. Who's asking? I'm a squire. Oh, a squire. That's interesting. Oh. I love a man who knows how to fight. The cute villager is splashing now. Who's your knight? It, is this really happening? I caught her interest. Oh, it's Sir Hugh. Oh, in before she said, ah, Hugh. Oh shit. Lost. We lost. <laughs> yeah. The Sir Hugh. And she's gonna leave me, okay, bye. Never mind. You know what? I left my name at home. Yep, we lost. Tell that perv to give it up already. <laughs> Ow! Oh shit, why you stab me though? Bye. <sighs> Should I mention Hugh? Damn it, I was this close. Thanks, you for nothing. That's it, I'm calling a day. I can only handle so many rejections. Besides, I can't stay up for too long. I don't want to wake up at noon tomorrow. Right, so we are going to sleep now at 8pm right now. We stay at the table though. I thought we were supposed to go, go back home. Oh yeah, we, we should. Right. Uh, but anything else we can interact? Nothing. I think this is just a tutorial, so we don't have, really have much to interact. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, we're just going back. And, where else but home? So, 8pm, home. So, by the time we get back home, it's 10pm. So, it actually takes, like, 2 hours to get from home to the table. That's, like, really far. Yeah. Okay, let's, let's play with the axe again. We're still chopping wood at night. <laughs> And the shake of this, and shake, and shake, and more of this. Alright, um, why well, aren't the lights on though? But anyway, let's go back into the house. Okay, everyone seems to be asleep already, so, uh, ah, there we go. Ah, now, now we get to interact the, the things here. We can light a fire at the fireplace. See what else. Oh, what's this? <laughs> can raise an arm. And let's see, the flower. Uh, anything? Oh, yeah, there we go. One interactable here. But why can't we see the mother's face though? Little Amy, Pops, and Mrs. Bowden. They all look sweet together. Hmm, but why isn't the, the why isn't my photo in here? <laughs> hmm. Yeah, then father we can't see the eyes, and then the mother's face we can't even see. It, yeah, we can't even see the ma the mother's face. Okay. Who? Cool. Okay, this is the yeah same thing. Ah, uh, what else we have here? 
books, books maybe. Nothing else we can interact. Yeah, so okay. I think we can like let this no. okay, alright, let, let's go back to the room. Go back, go upstairs. And back to my room. I wonder if that training paid off. Let's see the fruits of my labor. Oh, so this this macho sexy man poster is meant to see my training paid off. <laughs> Alright, it's not much but we'll get there. Um only two HP and I don't think it seems like there's no like leveling for for my character. Yeah, it's just upgrading of stats but there's no level and such. Okay. So let's just check a bit. So relationship yeah, so so Amy is not one of the one of the romanceable waifus. In fact which makes sense because Amy is, is yeah, is the the squire the main the MC sister, so and they don't promote incest rules. So, <laughs> but there are like five, yeah, five heroes here: Amy, Emily, Giselle, Beatrice, Kamala, and Belle. I wonder how this works. Maybe it's like when the heart is full, then you're like, then you, then that means you're really in love with uh the yeah the the, the girl. Oh yeah, and I I think I just saw something crawling at the bottom. Cockroach. Shit! Cockroach, get lost! Cockroach, kill ya! <laughs> okay, uh, oh, 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 the glass. <laughs> okay, uh, let's just check the calendar again. What's this year though? Let me see. This is, yeah, this is, um, my birthday. And what's this? Let me see. Gives monthly checkup. I shouldn't forget about that. Gives monthly checkup though. Okay, uh, let's see. Here we have the birthday, Amy's birthday. Hmm. Lady of the late winner, Albirin La Chef Fiona. Okay, 2069, so we're in the future. Okay, uh, let's see. Anything else we can interact here? Drawers. But it doesn't seem like there's anything. Yeah, we can light the candle here. So, okay. Shield. Painting is just this. No items right now. Okay, we're done for the day, so we're going to sleep. So, so what should I do? Rest and sleep, save. All right, we can just not rest. We're gonna rest and save. Yes. So, right. So that's the end of day one, and yeah, and I will see you probably. Yeah, I'm going to end this episode. Yeah, yeah, end off right here for this episode. So next episode, we're gonna continue this story as we go into day two. Yeah. So, yeah, that's it. I'll see you next time. And then...